One of the uses of this laser is for leveling machinery. Somebody brings this base in and it needs to be leveled. That's the way they, when they install a machine, they like to make it level, that's their reference. So we can set the laser on the floor stand and using the adjustments, adjust the, the, the laser itself until it's level, both levels, the pitch and the roll, fine and just. So now this laser is level. I can take this target, I'm gonna set it someplace on this base, I don't care where, and make it read zero. The point is, I'm gonna find the highest point. This may be the highest point. If everything on here is negative, then they're all lower. If I find a point that's higher, I'm gonna re-zero the target on that point. That's gonna be my starting point. I like to find the high point and then bring the rest of the machine up to that high point. It's easier to go up than it is to go down. So I move this to various spots and I see this over here. These are all going way negative. Way negative. Way negative. Back here. From zero there. Check this point. Just happens to be my high point. So I'm gonna re-zero it. Cause I don't, I'm not in the exact same spot I was in. So I can have a little bit different number. So every time I place this target on a spot, I'm gonna set it inside the footprint. Every place I put, set the target down, I'll make a footprint. So now I'm zero. This is my high point. I've zeroed it. Now I, I can take this to various points on here. I usually go over a leveling, leveling bolt. So if I have this here, and, and, and like in this case, here I'm well over 100 thousandths, well over 100 thousandths. So I can take my wrench and I can come down here and I can adjust this until I'm zero. I have live readings on the readout. So as I'm adjusting, I watch the numbers, bring it right to zero. So over each leveling point, I make the adjustment, watch the numbers on the readout until it comes to zero. That's how I level the machine.